So, like, Hunter, uh, don't let this go to your head, but I think you're okay. You do? Yeah, uh, I mean, I see you trying to make me feel included, and I thought I should take a moment to thank you for not leaving me out. Caretaker makes me feel like a child sometimes, but you don't, so, like, thanks. You are most welcome, Nico. It is an honor to fight by your side. Honor? Oh, man. Listen, Hunter, uh, don't take this the right way, because I totally appreciate the compliment, but you really need to drop the formality and loosen up before Magic starts calling you a boomer. Boomer? It's slang for ancient, outdated one who caused all of our problems. Huh. Well, that describes me exactly. You know what? <laughs> Never mind. I'm gonna try and forget that you said that. I guess what I'm trying to say is, I see you making an effort to not make me feel like a complete reject, and I appreciate that. I need all the allies I can get on this apocalyptic reality show because I do not want to get voted out of this abbey or off this world. Reality show? Vote? Just try and not get eliminated, Hunter. Hunter, we have finished the symbiote sampling device. Come to the forge to have a look. Peter. Oh, you are gonna love this. Hey, boss. I got something for you. Here you are, Hunter. One symbiote sampler. Hot off the old demonic presses. That... is not what I expected. Yes, I for one am not going anywhere near that thing. You're a doctor. Don't tell me you're afraid of a little needle. That is most certainly not a needle. Well, you say tomato, I say one gamma-infused arc-powered laser tomato. Either way, we're good to go. Now we just have to get close enough to Venom to use it. And I suppose you have a plan for that, too. Actually, I don't. Been too busy wrangling our friendly Forge Demon while ignoring Strange's advice in order to build a one-of-a-kind gamma-powered symbiote extractor that burns hot enough to pierce the sun. But basically, we just need to stick the pointy end in him and let the device do the rest. Once we jab that thing, the symbiote will be extracted and stored within the chamber. The fluid inside should maintain the sample's molecular integrity indefinitely. I, uh, based it on the saliva he left on you during that last round. I see. And does Spider-Man, Peter, think it will actually work? I'm not sure. To be honest, I've kind of been keeping him out of the loop on this one. Look, Peter's a great kid. With a big heart. He looks at Venom, and he doesn't see the same mucus monster we do. All he sees is Eddie Brock. From what he's told me, the two of them weren't exactly best friends before the symbiote got thrown into the mix. But that doesn't matter to Peter. It's not gonna be easy to get that sample. We'll have to get real close. I know Peter would give anything, including his own life, to save Eddie. Guess I just don't want to see him distracted when the time comes. Look what happened to me with Bruce. Venom is not Banner, Tony, and Peter is not you. Well, that's the point. I... I look at Peter and I see... Well, maybe the person I could have been if I didn't let money, fame, and... My dad's war profiteering get the best of me. Maybe I just want to keep the kid... a kid... for as long as possible. <sighs> Tony... End of the day, we gotta find Venom first before any of this matters. 
Given his symbiote is happily sliming its way across the five burrows, it's going to be hard getting any kind of reading on him with conventional means, as in the non-demonically possessed kind. Thankfully, there's always Auntie Caretaker and her magic mirror. I'd check in with her. Talk to you soon, Hunter. Hello? Welcome to Tony's Scary Demon Cave. I'm Tony, and how may I assist you today? How's that for quality workmanship? Magical mystery box. Later. How are you, Peter? You tell me, Hunter. I'm out of the loop on everything. They're off discussing what to do about Venom, and no one has said a word to me about it. Maybe they are trying to protect you, Peter. They see your youth and feel the need to shield you a bit. I've saved the city I don't know how many times. What do I have to do to prove myself? Grow a goatee like Strange? I do not think that is necessary. Good, because it would be way too itchy under the mask. I know it can be frustrating, but you should not waste time wallowing in it. I know, I should be doing something, because right now I feel kind of useless. Maybe I'll use the forge to bake a loaf of sourdough. Really get in Stark's way until he notices me. If you want Stark to pay attention to you, there are better ways to make your point than making bread. Well, I was kidding about that, but if you have suggestions... Just walk up to him and suggest a way to help. Okay, okay, you've made your point. Ah, <sighs> fine. Maybe I'll speak up. Excellent. Just give me a bit. I'm a little rusty. The Sinister Six caused me to miss out on my speech class final. I want to ask Bruce. What's the latest intel? Okay, what's Hydra up to now? Great intel. Bad news for the world. Let's fix it. Got some ops ready for you. Bye. Ready for some hero work? I'll make it my highest priority. Thanks, Hunter. I guess I could show you a couple of things. Caretaker could have at least left me a chair. Ready for more? There 
it is. The creature. And pretty much the entire Hydra offensive. No doubt stealing more of the priceless and, did I mention, extremely powerful artifacts housed within the Sanctum? I don't think so. They're fortifying a position here. You're right. We're never going to get close enough to get a symbiote sample. Oh, I wouldn't say never. Venom problem? No problem. Wow. You got some serious range on that old Spidey sense, kid. Or he got my text. Either way, I'm your guy. Come on, team. I got an idea. <sighs> Anyone? Definitely should have practiced that more in the mirror. Sorry, kid. Can't risk a field trip on this one. Yeah, because you all have so much experience fighting Venom. Spider-Man's cunning has proven to far exceed his years. In battle, not the talking. Don't see any of us muscling in when the Mandarin's in town. <laughs> okay, fine. I get it. What's the plan, ki Uh, Spider-Man? Listen, I'm not a control freak. If you have any good ideas on the mission, I'm all in. My only idea is to not get killed. Oh, come on. We're totally insane. Given their history together, I suppose it does make sense to trust Spider-Man on this plan of his. What's the worst that could happen? Actually, don't answer that. Happy to oblige. Cross, crossbones, and Eddie, and a really big... What is that? Whatever it is, they brought an entire army to protect it. Uh-huh. Sorry, just need to make a last-second adjustment to the plan. Ah, uh, yes. The plan. What is it? Right. Okay, stay low, wait for my signal. The time wasted. Suppressing gamma energy versus harnessing it. Oh, when Mother sees what I have accomplished. What's up, Doc? Eat his brains. Signal! Signal! That was a signal! work. Well, it did that one time. Parker, report. Parker, status. Well, I am under a little pressure, but Eddie's right where I want him. Hey! Soon we eat. 
I take it we're on to plan B. Uh, I'd say it's probably more like plan 1.5. I'm betting those smaller bells vibrate at a similar frequency to their big brother. May not be perfect, but they could buy me the time I need to get that sample. We have your sample right here, little spider. Yep, walked right into that one. Your fate is sealed. That's a neat trick. This one's for you! Just the boost I needed! Like it's up to me. Leave some for the rest of us. I'm going for it. First you die, then we eat! No scampering away! Can't break free! Suddenly it smells like spoiled milk around here. Arm Alpha, reinforcing! We will always remember this place! moved on from wanting to eat my brain, now he's just trying to bury me. That's progress, right? Just hit him with the bells, please. Move like that once centuries ago. Hail that. Big time's over. Pain only makes us hungrier. Movement here. They're displacing. Oh. 
Monoforms are for the weak! Damn it, what are you made of? I have not been hit like that since... ever. Hey, cut that out! We're not done. <sighs> we have longed for this moment, little spider, to squash you here in this cursed place. When you are gone, we shall feast upon you. <laughs> Hey, Eddie, I know that's just Lilith talking through you or whatever, but shut up already! Maybe you should teach me that one. I'm on it. Come get it. We will never forsake her. Sure, just do whatever the last guy did. Here. Hold position. Your web is broken, little spider. Your trap has failed! He may be right. This symbiote sample is not worth your life, Spider-Man. We can find another way. Tell that to Aunt May, Mary Jane, Harry, Flash, Felicia, Otto, and about nine million other New Yorkers we're trying to save. If getting that sample means we can stop your mother from destroying this city, it's worth the risk. Just buy me some time. Time's up, these jumps. I had hoped for a challenge. About time. Stop 
suffer for that! We will crack your tiny bones! I've never been punched by a fluid before! Looks like they have help. We cannot keep this up forever. But we can. Do you really think your puny bell of tin and copper can defy the power of the Midnight Sun? Silver! Seventh grade trip to the Liberty Bell! We will make you feel regret. A new line of work. Mother tells us to hurry. No escaping this. Get this thing off me. No time to be our wounds. Lilith must really want me out of the picture. Support units on the move! It's too bad you couldn't meet my new team under better circumstances, Eddie! Lilith will not look kindly on this one. This shall be of great help. Weak, even for Hydra. Hey, that 
That hurts! Your time has come! Ooh, I like it! Now that was something. All right, I felt that one. Reinforcements inbound. I will be keeping my organ meat. Thank you very much. Service. 
I may require aid here. Watch close. <laughs> we will heal faster than you. Who's next? I think they like me. Reinforcements on approach. I liked it better when aliens were just little gray guys. I will not fall again. What? Mess with the wrong crew. Get ready. They cannot possibly match your strength. The light is on our side. That was refreshing. For Hydra! Why don't you just eat a hot dog cart or something? Why is it always about the organs, huh? You are lucky to still be breathing. Try this on for size! Go again! 
should come in handy. We are too strong for you. Stand here. Stop this guy already. I suppose we should not underestimate this thing. More Hydra coming in quick! My respect for Spider-Man grows every time I am forced to look into this creature's drooling maw. Welcome assistance. Walk in the light. Let us see if they have an answer for this. by a hell lord sticky just stop already i have spotted enemy reinforcements perhaps if someone fed the creature it would stop complaining so much Powerful as Lilith had hoped. We've got it. Let's do this. of ours, Eddie? Think it's time we changed it up. So how about we try a little smash-up? <laughs> what? That not a thing anymore? Let's find out. Now this might sting for just a second, but that's perfectly natural. Something I like to call the plan. got two teams digging for venom as we speak. He may want to add two or three more. Just saying. 
You dropped a church on him. I doubt he's going anywhere. Parker? Uh-oh. I have seen that look before. Congratulations. On a job well done. Aw, uh, thanks everyone. I'll remember this moment forever. Which is probably how long it's gonna take me to pay the church's repair bill. Oh, not to worry. Thankfully, we have a billionaire in the house. Yeah, at least Stark's credit card is good for something. Oh, these kids. Real sweethearts. Good plan, Peter. Executed like a champ. Craziest plan I ever saw in my life. Still can't believe he pulled that off. Yes, and now we must make use of the sample he recovered. Um, we? All right, everyone. I know you all have a lot more important things to do than cheer little old me on. Let's go save the world. Oh, and if anyone happened to record any of this, feel free to send it my way. For training purposes, of course. Next time? Just between you and me, I wasn't 100% sure that little plan would pay off out there. I mean, I was pretty sure, but I still had that little voice in the back of my head. If you screw this up, Venom's gonna be snacking on your skull! Even worse, I would've let you down, not to mention the others. I always knew you would succeed, Peter. Enjoy the praise you received. Thanks. It's kinda nice to be the man of the hour. Even if it only lasts... Uh, an hour. Spent so long trying to keep Spider-Man and Peter Parker separate from each other, I never really had the chance to celebrate victories with... You know... Friends? Exactly. Thank you for that, Hunter. However you look at it, be glad we got the sample. Now we can get the dock home, keep you less explodey? All around, a good day. We all owe you a thanks. I was nothing. Besides, helping the boss man test his top secret prototype on a demonically possessed alien symbiote human hybrid has got to look good to the folks at Stark Industries. Would love to get a shot to work for Tony one day. Just wish Spider Man could submit a resume. But you are working with Tony, Peter. You are an integral member of the team. Whoa. Mind just. Peter? Nope. Mind's still blown. I just need to sit here and let it all sink in, Hunter. I'll, uh, I'll talk to you soon. I knew Peter was going to come through. Parker's debrief is gonna be one for the ages. I think I ticked off Captain Marvel, and wow, that is nothing I expected to say in my lifetime. What happened? She caught me bringing an armload of snacks to my room, asked if I was hoarding food. She was joking, but kind of not joking. I haven't lived with people outside of family. Am I doing it wrong? Do, do I write an apology note, or how do I fix this? Did you often raid the pantry when you were living at home? Not really. I'd grab an extra fruit pie now and again, but I just took what I needed. Then pretend you are at home. That should be easy. Caretaker is a scary version of my aunt. We're doing this again, right? start actually listening to us for a change. Still reading Wanda's grimoire, I see. Yeah? Why? You got an opinion about it? No, not really. Good, because I really don't give a crap what anyone thinks anymore. I uh, just want Wanda back. And I think I may have an idea how to get her back. Well... Sorta. According to her grimoire, it looks like Agatha was helping Wanda control her connection to chaos magic. 
And since Chaos Magic is a hell of a lot more powerful and ancient than Lilith, I'm thinking there's a way I can figure out how to use it to undo Lilith's hold on her. Chaos Magic is the darkest and most treacherous magic you can play with. It is said to come from Cathan himself. If you are planning on dabbling in it, you will need my help. Uh, you're not, like, afraid of messing with hardcore Elder God magic and inventing a potentially dangerous new spell? I am dangerous. Okay, danger. You can help me by not telling Caretaker what I'm up to. She doesn't believe Lil and Corruption can be undone and will totally try and stop me. She lacks your imagination. <laughs> she lacks more than that. Well, if we're really gonna try this, I've got a lot of reading to do to try and figure this out. And I shall keep your secrets. Mum's the word, Hunt.